Hey, what is up YouTube? My name's Tim, this is Original Guitar Riffs. Today I've got something for you that's a little bit trickier, but if you can hammer on and pull off with a little bit of practice, you should be fine. Besides, what guy doesn't want more practice at pulling off? Okay, so I'm going to play through it once and then hopefully I can zoom in and show you how to play it too. Okay, so let's break this down. Once we slow it down a little bit, it's not nearly as tricky as it sounds. So we're starting on the third and the fifth fret of the G string, and this is where you start pulling it off. I, I can't think of another way to word that. Okay, so let's start breaking that down. Once you slow it down, it's not nearly as tricky as it sounds. Starts here on the fifth fret of the G string, and the third, and then open. So that's the sequence that we're pulling off. It's the very first bit. And then we drop down to the fifth fret on the D string. So, open, open. So just third and fifth on the D string as well. So we're really only using two fingers and two frets. That's the first bit. It's ending on the open and we'll just cut it off wherever. Just mute it. Now this next bit, it's a double stop on the fifth fret of the G and the B and the third. But we're putting a slight bend in there as well. from the first bit then we go back into the first bit again now it changes here a little bit we're going to slide from the fifth to the seventh and back again so it's five slide to seven five three and then ending on five on the D string Okay, then we repeat the same sequence again. Now this last little bit, this is a bit trickier. It's a quick hammer on from open on the D and then the G, third and fifth fret. And when we get to here, we're going to slide that up to the seventh as well. And we've got six, eight, six, eight on the B and E strings. Now that's ending on the eighth fret of the B string. Now it's quite a simple little blues box, that shape. We can run around all over the place in this shape here. From the G string, seventh fret, we go either side on the two strings up. places that we can take it. So if we go back down here we're starting open up open hammering on the G string sorry the uh, D string now the reason I like ending things here at least this particular riff is because of that little blues box we've got lots of places we can go with it Okay guys, there you go. Have a crack at that one and see how you go. Now I've been having a lot of fun getting used to my new rig, so if you like these videos be sure to leave a comment down below, or if you think they're a bit shit, leave a comment down below and I'll try to make them a little bit less shit and I'll see you on the next Original Guitar Riffs. Okay, thank you!